good morning guys good morning i hope you guys are doing good um okay what can i say i'm awake god all of us are fine so i'm okay yeah i'm okay we slept well the electricity is back now we didn't have electricity for two days the electricity is back now so today it's a friday and the kids were supposed to go to school they were supposed to go to school but sadly the transport was not able to arrive and uh, then now they are sitting here the other one is looking at me and then the other one is crying the big one is crying the small one is looking at me shaking you make a milk chocolate what what and what was i going to say they told Umakulu that it transported was almost on fire yesterday. It was on fire, but not Yonke. The, the, I don't know what's the name of it. Uh, so today it didn't arrive. It's somewhere in the freeway there by the bridge. M17 is stuck there. So the kids are now at home. And the big one was supposed to do it oral today. The due date is today. It's today. I knew this was going to happen. I said it yesterday. After they told me the transport was on fire. And I was like, I don't think by is of I'm clenched. It happened. It's not here. So the kids are here at home with me. I don't know what's going to happen. And I also wrote for Itishara. Not responding, not even re re reading the messages that I wrote. I wrote yesterday before, after 6 I wrote because I came late. So I had the message late. I had to write for Utishara because I couldn't wait. Emergency, transport was on fire. They did go to school but they were at school around 9. Around 9 and then my son told the teacher and my daughter told the teacher also. But there was no response. I also even write this morning for Utishara what's happening also no response I, I don't know okay, what to do at this point i don't know they gave us a group whatsapp group for us to communicate if there's a problem a matter issue but the group is not opened for us for all the parents the group is not open so the only thing that we have to do as parents we must write for a teacher we, we message like exactly direct to the teacher not to the group so now if the teacher is not responding, I don't know what else to do. I don't know. Anyways, the kids are here at home. Everyone is here at home. So now, yeah, I'm going to continue the video with them here at home. That's what I'm going to do. Uh, see you guys when I see you. I don't know. Yeah, see you when I see you. It's going to be a long day. Hey, guys. I don't know what to do when I'm at home I don't know what to do that's the thing and yeah today I'm supposed to rest tired supposed mm. to rest but mm. I am quickly going to to shop right and I want to get some few things for the house and also want to buy a washing powder and get a few toiletries that I need to get so yeah you guys are going with me to show bright. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go.
Hey guys, I am back. I am back. I don't know if that thing is going to give me a copyright or not. I don't know. But my mother is watching, not watching, is listening to a radio. So I hope it's not going to give me a copyright. I am back. I am so tired. I don't know why it's jingle in the show. I'm tired. It's far. Where I came from. It's so, so far. And I'm wearing this see through top, as you guys can see. Tired. Just going to do a small anyana haul. A small haul because I went to buy those small things. Okay, so I got macaroni. Got macaroni. Oil. We do have a huge oil, huge five liter oil here. But again, it's it's a hundred and hop combo, so many oil, obvious. Manayo. And you guys saw what you saw these things. Got this. We already saw them. This rice. Yeah, this rice. They only have shop right brand now. Uh, shop right is getting expensive, especially this shop right. 2 kg, meal, meal. Next week, I must do a real shopping, not this one. And I got myself this perfume. It's the, it's similar to Leana, the last one that I bought. It's similar to it. And it smells good, Shem. Mama, it's the same in that one. Yeah, it's the same in that one. Man. Yeah, I bought this same. one, but this one is another but, but it's a flavor. This one that I got, at least when you smell good, is, a girl must have a smell. A girl must have a smell. That's what they have to do. And I bought this pack of chips for the kids. And bought this slice of cake for the kids. You need to make like this for the kids. Got myself some pets. Yeah. At least I'm done. I'm finished. I'm not gonna use these ones now. I'm gonna use them next month. I have to buy the normal ones that I I buy. You <laughs> Oh my goodness, I'm getting old. I'm forgetting things. I'm forgetting things. Got Colgate closets. And. Jesus, I got two bars of soap. I thought I bought the same. I got two bars of soap. I love both of them. Got two bars of soap. One for me, one for my mother. The other one is going to stay here. The other one is going to the other one is going to stay here. The other one is going to the other side. At least it's going to cover us until my pain date and I bought the face one gentle magic you guys saw it you what guys is saw that? it what is I bought this for me the review I want to test this one they this they they sell these small versions of yeah because I couldn't buy e I couldn't get um it's center skin. I couldn't get. Is it a center skin? I don't know how do you pronounce that thing. I couldn't center get it. Skin. The 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 one that I buy, small one, or the other one that I bought. They only have those huge ones, and it's ninety rand. I didn't have ninety rand at this time, what so I will buy it next next week. I will buy it next week because I really need it. I love it so much. So now I only bought this one. I'm gonna use this one for now. This is the one that I'm going to use. And for those who are traveling, at least you could get these sizes. For the travelers, you can get these sizes. It's good for them. And for me, that I will, I will have a sleepover in the end of the month. I will sleep there at work. So I must buy myself something like this. Small pack. This is going to help. But this is going to help. And bought these for the kids. They are shop right. As you guys know that we can't buy anything from the shops now because there's this thing that is happening now. There's this thing that is happening now here in South Africa. The foreigners are selling things, poisonous things to the kids and the kids are dying. Five Last week it was six kids and the other one it was three 
First it was three kids. They bought it already from the tuck shops and then all the kids died. And then there was five. They buried the five. After the five, the other one also passed away because they bought chips. They bought no. Because they bought chips. The first one bought porridge from the tuck shop. They passed away. The second one bought chips. I think there was a six year old to ten year old. There were six of them. So they bought a chips and then they all all of them shared with that one pack of chips and then all of them passed away. As they said the chips were poisoned. They were poisoned inside the chips. And it's most of the place that it's happening is in Jobek. It's happening there. And now I don't know what the other one happened, but it also happened. And now today in the news, 25 school children, 25 school children, they were rushed to hospital because they went to, I don't know if some of the people listen to the news or what's happening, 25 school children ate something that they bought at the tuck shop and now all of them, they are sick. All of them, they were sick. They were rushed to in, house, in the hospital. From school to hospital, imagine. I've been telling my kids, please, even if someone is giving you something that they bought from the shop, I am buying things from them, for them, from Kwa Shoprite or Waspa or whatever I'm going, where I'm going to do promotions, and then I know that I'm going to get a small anyana, same thing, then I'm going to buy those cakes for them. Yo, okay, guys, it's hard. Kids are dying. Kids are dying. I don't know what's happening. I don't know if the, the, the foreigners are trying to kill us or what's happening. Because all of these shops, they're getting poisoned, poisoned, poisoned from all the shops. And now we can't trust the one that we have. We are, yeah. we are friends with them. I love speaking to them. I love laughing to them. But now it's going to be that issue of trust. Like, how are we going to eat these things if kids are dying kids are dying like day by day you wake up they are telling us this happened that happened it's so hectic it's so crazy it's so bad like oh my goodness these people were taking them as families and now this is happening they are saying south africa is a very xenophobic xenophobic country we are not xenophobic we are trying to protect our country that's the only thing that we are trying to do you see now they are going to say something else about this thing that is happening we are also trying to protect our kids the children are dying and now it's an issue that they 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 i don't know where in hamastra or where they beaten one foreign person who killed a south african person who was selling also who at the shop i don't know what the argue was about but now they are going to say it's a xenophobic we are trying to stop them from selling the things and now they are saying us we are wrong why are we closing the shops they are selling expired things they are saying poisonous things and now we are the problems the south africans are the problems how is that when you guys are killing our kids the only hopes that we have in this world you guys are doing that and now we are xenophobic that's that's crazy i don't understand what if a south african go to your country and then sell things to your kids and then they pass away what are you guys going to do are you going to be like oh that was a mistake let's just let it a mistake that's happening every day every day kids are dying every day because of the snacks the things the, the cool drinks that are, they are selling no uh -uh, this is this is crazy we love you guys so much you guys are doing the best job in south africa but now you come to that point that is not cool at all there was kidnapping there was raping there was hijacking there was shooting all of the stuff and now they are targeting the kids now the innocent kids no this is not good this is not good at all anyway guys i didn't come here to talk and do whatsoever i didn't come here to do that now i'm going to relax and chill and try and watch some youtubers because i i don't know what's playing on tv I'm going to try and watch some youtubers and relax i think i will catch you guys later i don't know but <clears throat> i don't know i don't have anything else to do now rather than sit and chill
if you break it if you break it you know, my son is playing with that perfume that's why i'm saying break it because now that was the last scent that i had to buy that perfume i don't have anything else i'm going to wait for payday to buy myself another perfume again everything is expensive now everything is expensive like everything is expensive like crazy guys i will catch you next time i don't know i will see but bye